deadline hits. Anyway, I was saying something. What was my point? Um, my point was, yeah. Okay, so um, good morning and welcome. Um, as promised. So what we have here is 94 pages of romance, drama, comedy, action, adventure, travel, sibling rivalry, other stuff. So yes, we got lots, lots of notes. Um, basically, we had we had a reading. Uh, it was last week. Uh, it went really well. There were so many amazing notes given at this reading. I was blown away by the talents um, of the people who showed up and uh, such insightful comments. Yeah, it was amazing. It was organized by the Backbone Theatre. Um, if you're in London and you're a writer, check them out because it wasn't a case of like, oh, I liked this bit. Now that I've got a good idea of the script and some really helpful, super hilarious and exciting notes from those amazing people, I am going to do a treatment uh, and condense it down to three pages, send it out with a poster or two, some of the castles we want to be shooting at. I'll save that for another video. We understood the structure, the character. Um, yeah, Timon came out of it. Uh, one of my characters came out of it um, actually as a real character, uh, which I think up until that reading he had not been, but the actor just dove into it and um, yeah, I had a much bigger sense of, of who Timon was at the end of that. So th that was amazing. I could not recommend them enough. So what's next? Well, I've been gunning towards this particular deadline for months and I've got to say now uh, we've got to find our funds. So this is probably the bit I'm most scared about. I've got a pitch. Uh, I think I'm going to film a pitch video and put it up on the site. Five million. Judging from the reactions I've had, you know, once the film is made, selling it should be not too difficult. So here is the plan. Um, the first individual or company to invest 50 to 150 thousand pounds will be named executive producer in the project no matter what. So uh, some quick math for you there. If our ideal budget is five million, then our 50,000 is you invest just 1% of the total budget we're trying to raise, you will still get an executive producer credit. So I think that's a pretty good deal and that's just to get the ball rolling. Um, I'm definitely going to try for the 51 fund. Any female filmmakers out there, they had a call to action. They said, if you're a female director, direct a mid-budget feature. None of that micro-budget shit. Get yourself a mid-budget feature because there's not enough women who are going for it. So if you're watching this and you're thinking, hmm, I'm ready to try a feature, like, do what I'm doing, jump in the deep end, make a big mid-budget. There's someone out there with the money to fund you. Um, and we want to see your movies. Like, I've, I've seen enough movies about white guys. Oh no, Man Damon's small in this one. But there's only so many times you can watch the same Transformers movie before you just gouge your own eyes out. Um, anyway, <laughs> here's, here's a quick example of what it might look like. Are you good at business? Do you like taking risks? Well, <laughs> no, basically my plan is, and it's worked so far, is just to tell people the story. It's only $50,000. <laughs> just kidding, it's 150. Like, this is a movie, what do you think we're doing? Like, no, we, we need funds. <laughs> So, um, job for this week, treatment. Um, hopefully, that's what I'll do to ensure that I do it in the next video. Instead of, as I promised, standing here with a script, I will stand here with a treatment. Um, and that will be the plan. Um, oh, I also went to paper chase. Look at this. This is gonna be my lookbook. It's all tied with ribbon. Um, it's gonna be amazing. I'm really looking forward to this. <laughs> yeah, so now that... <sighs> Now that the, the stress of thinking like I'm never gonna get this script done, like it's done. 
So that's over and I can focus on some of the more fun stuff like my lookbook. Happy 2018. Um, I hope you guys are all killing your goals. Um, at the end of the day, like, I am the most procrastinatory person in the world. So if I can stand there with a goddamn finished draft of my screenplay, then you can do whatever it is, whatever, you know? Whatever you want to be, you will be in the end. Uh, that's a Moody Blues lyric for you there. I'm very happy with this script. Um, yes, I, I worked hard, it paid off, and that's all you need, you know? I wish all of you well. I hope that you live a happy life. I hope that you are a positive impact in this world and you can do whatever it is, whatever your dream or goal or just thing that you're thinking like that you've always had in your head like since you were a kid. You can do it. You, you can do it. You got this. Like if I can write a feature film and if I can make it, you can do whatever. Like I'm a girl and I'm making a feature film. And like honestly, there's so many guys who would have you believe that like being a director is like the most delicate and difficult. How could anybody do this? Basically, if life's going a bit shit, just make a movie. I guarantee you'll feel better. Just lots of really amazing things. Okay, watch this, hold on. <laughs> and of course, um, please subscribe to our YouTube channel um, and like Fish Overboard on Facebook for more updates, information, and tips and tricks on how to make a film.